My speech today will consist of 10 pieces of advice for our graduating class. So number one, always find joy in laughter. Laughter improves the function of blood vessels and increases healthy blood flow. In a world filled with people who only care about themselves, you are all a breath of fresh air. Though we may be a small class, I am sure we will have a big impact on the world. We will make even more great memories, but never forget where you came from and who you grew up. Secondly, remember love wherever you go in life. Nathan, you left and then you came back. And if I'm not mistaken, the boomerang you was even nicer and better than before. I know that leaving high school, everyone probably has some amount of anxiety. Try your best to handle your anxiety. Whatever happens, happens. Thirdly, exceed the expe expectations of others. You are more than conquerors. Number four, work hard. Whatever you do in life, work at it with all of your heart as if you're working for something greater. Hannah, who goes out and makes a one-woman sports team? You do. I'm pretty sure we've all had that awkward moment when we're in a hallway and we run into another person. I couldn't leave this gym without mentioning Diego. I remember he was dancing down the hall with his earbuds in. He was waving a bathroom pass around as if it were a lightsaber, that he was funny and drove the teachers crazy. Diego had a heart of gold. And we're lucky that some of his family is here tonight. Number five, be thankful in all circumstances. Today someone didn't wake up, but you did. There is a plan, there is a destiny, there is a purpose for why you are here today. Connor, oh my. <laughs> Others will become engineers, lawyers, hairdressers. However, nurses are the best. Number six, be anxious for nothing. When you step into the real world after today and you begin to meet new people, be at peace. You got it, man. Graduation isn't just about us. It's about the bigger picture. Alan, the striped shirt that you always wore under your Hass uniform, you will forever be the Hamburglar in my mind's eye. Number seven, have faith for the impossible. Meaning the things you hope for in life, be convinced that they are yours. My encouragement to you is to run until you achieve what you are looking for. Number eight, guard your heart above all else because it determines the course of your life. Your personality has the potential to transform the atmosphere. Without a doubt, everyone in the class of 2019 will have their own positive impact on the world in their own way. Scratching your ear is kind of a miracle, depending on how you look at it. Isaiah, you are a funny guy. Though you may be vertically challenged, people definitely look up to you. Number nine, never forget who you are. Our memories will live on within us for as long as we'll have them. Finally, always consider time. Consider time because one day, it's your first day as a freshman walking into those doors of the past. And by the time you know it, you've graduated college, you're married to a beautiful lady by the name of Claudia, and you have a son by the name of Joseph River. <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna miss you all. Congratulations, 2019 class. Ladies and gentlemen, please move your tassel to the left. We'd like to introduce everyone to the Haas 2000.